Don't always think about the honey, what bees can give to you. It's actually what you can give to the bees. Uh, yes, I'm Clarence from The Sundowner. This is a company we started around two plus years ago. Uh, we offer experiences on this rooftop garden, as you can see, and one of our specializations, right, is bee rescues over here. Why are bees important? Yeah. Okay, many people regard bees as pests, uh, in the same category as mosquitoes and cockroaches. Right. Uh, but actually, bees are one of the cleanest animals around. They don't carry any pathogens or diseases that can pass on to humans. So in that way, they are very... Uh, dissimilar to the classic pests that make us uh, sick uh, in dirty places. Mm -hmm. uh, but the, the, the true value of bees are, actually is not even honey. Uh, many people, when they think of bees, they think of the sweet reward of honey. Right. Mm -hmm. But the value of pollination that bees bring uh, actually is worth uh, 55 billion uh, in the, around the world. Pollination services, that means when they cross the female flower with the male flower pollen, resulting in the fruits, that is the most important things that bees bring for the yeah. environment. Yeah. They help us with food, not just food, but forest ecology, forest health, plant reproduction, even the grass that you see growing on our roadside uh -huh. is pollinated by bees also. So Killam Pest is one of the few companies in Singapore that is quite visionary. Uh, uh, despite what the name suggests, uh, they, they don't kill the bees. They, maybe they used to, I'm not sure. Yeah. But uh, the new approach with Killam Pest is that they want to do something to save the bees. Uh, in terms of uh, bee rescuers in Singapore, there are very few. I'm the youngest, the newest and the youngest. So when they get a call, uh, they will uh, approach me with the situation from the client, telling me what is the problem, how do I access it. And I will tell them, okay, this one you can do, we climb the ladder, we will relocate it. When can we do it? At night is the best time to relocate the bees. And uh, instead of what used to be a kill job, now is a rescue job. We bring the bees here to our apiary, as you can see. Then we give them a safe space to fly around and, and forage from all the flowers, as you can see all around you. Okay, the funny thing is, when people find a beehive in the property, sometimes it has been there for weeks or even months, they don't even realise it. That's actually how peaceful bees are. Uh, if you think of a mosquito, mosquito come and find you and right. suck your blood. Bees are just doing their thing, finding flowers. So sometimes people, there's even such a big one that they see before uh, in their garden, it's been there for months. So in such cases, I would say, maybe you can even just leave it there. Okay, but if they really want to remove it because they are children or pets, pets or what in the area, Okay, what we will do is uh, tell them to wait for nightfall. That's when bees are more calm, they are sleeping. They also cannot see at night. So it is safer to relocate them. We will do something to make them calm down even more. Okay, we will do the extraction, put it in a box. If they are so tame uh, that we can even take a picture with the bees, I hold one end, the uh, client hold one end and we can take a picture together. After that, we bring it to our apiary here. And then when the bees wake up the next day, wow, they are in a new place. New environment. New environment, a new safe place, yes. So last year, we did around 100 bee rescues. Uh, the year before is much less because last year, we did many collaborations with uh, pest control companies such as Killam. 100 bee nests, okay, you average of 5,000 bees is 500,000 bees, half a million bees. Uh, the year before, maybe 50, so we are approaching uh, three quarter million bees, 750,000 bees. This year, we started off very fast already. Uh, we've already done, I think, 15 bee rescues. So I think, uh, definitely by middle of this year, we will hit uh, 1 million bees safe. La. Now, you imagine 1 million bees. Uh, can you imagine this number of bees? If uh, someone say every day they take care of one uh, caterpillar mm. and they release one butterfly every day, wow, they will be a superstar. Every year they re release 365 butterflies, uh, wow, they will be heralded as a champion. But imagine the number of bees that we have helped save with uh, uh, companies like Killam. 750,000 already to date. That is really a profound impact, I would think, on the Singapore ecology of all the flowers, plants, vegetables, reproduction. The message on bees is uh, don't always think about the honey, what bees can give to you. It's actually what you can give to the bees. So 
you give them a safe space, you can call a relocator like Kilam, Sundowner, Fire Sundowner. Okay, we are giving them a chance to live again rather than being killed. Okay, sometimes people will smoke them and chase it away to another house, but the other house will kill them. Correct. So Correct. they need to bring it, what they can do for the bees. Ultimately, this will help them also by, in terms of making our forest more green, more grass on the roadside, and uh, even vegetables nowadays growing on kapak rooftops. Correct. All this will cycle back and benefit us in terms of the larger ecology picture. Yeah. Let's save the bees. We are proud to partner with Kilim Pet.